hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Coffee here. And today, of course, we're back with a Diamond Art Club sneak peek. Yes. So first things first, as usual, huge thank you to the folks over at Diamond Art Club for providing this sneak peek for us. And what did they send us? You guys, I don't think you're ready for this. It is absolutely gorgeous. The Wild Wood. Oh my God. So this is a 50.7 by 65.8 round with ABs and it's by Inya Morte. It is stunning. So let's go ahead and get into this without further ado. I hope you're all having a wonderful, wonderful day. And if not, do something nice for yourself. You deserve it. Get, get yourself something nice or wait until Saturday. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get into this. We're going to pretend like we know how to use a knife and get into this kit. There we go. Get this plastic off here. Nice fresh kit for us. And then we're gonna open up the box. And we of course have our tool kit. And our sticker is in here somewhere. So we're just gonna pull it out like this, bam, there we go. So then what's gonna happen is on the side of this kit, you get this sticker for your journaling purposes for whatever you use it for. I personally, because I stack these up in my closet when I'm not working on them, I'm just going to put the sticker right here so that when I stack it up, I know exactly what kit it is when I put it away. So there's that. And then we have our tool kit. Each tool kit is unique, but we're going to show you what's in mine. It looks like I have an orange pen, which means I also have an orange squishy that matches. You're going to get some wax, some baggies, a couple of multi-placers, but you're also going to get washi tape and a cover minder. The cover reminder is to hold the plastic back on your kit for whenever you're diamond painting. And the washi tape is just to decorate the sides of it and also to keep your drill straight on the edges. So we have some beautiful watercolor washi tape there. And then we have this adorable bear with a strawberry. I'm so cute. We love it. So that is what comes in your toolkit. Now, the only difference between a round and a square toolkit is that the squares will come with a pair of tweezers where the rounds will not. So you're going to get rid of that. And I don't know why they do that. That's just how they do. Um, so here is our kit. Let's break this bad boy open because I am excited to see this. It is a gorgeous kit. There are your drills. That pur purple paper that Becky loves. The Wild Wood by Inya Morte. There's a start and end date. There is your image. Let's go. She is gorgeous. Oh, she has horns and everything. Oh my God, you guys. 50.7 by 65.8 round with ABs. And it looks like we're coming in at 39 colors. Oh my gosh. So let's go ahead and take a look at this canvas. Let's see how they rendered this because it has a small human in it. Doing portraits is easy. Doing bigger like like bigger images with people in them can sometimes make them pixelated. So let's see how they rendered it. Now, do I have any doubt that Diamond Art Club didn't do a an amazing job? No. Bam. <gasps> wow. Wow. I almost cussed. <laughs> Holy crap. That is amazing. Oh my God, that looks amazing. I'm not even a big fan of dark colors when it comes to diamond painting, but you're seeing a lot of like, like browns and uh, like, I want to say that's black because I, I know that Diamond Art Club color, that's black that you're seeing there. You're getting a lot of that color blocking confetti in this kit as you're getting this like mirror that this person is in. And I love the fact that they broke across the mirror there. You can see that there with the antler. Oh my God, this is gorgeous. Look at the detail on those roses. Let's get you closer. You didn't, you, you didn't, I don't think you saw the detail. I don't know if you can even appreciate this. Look at the antlers coming out of the, the, the mirror there. You got the roses on the side and the one that she's holding. Even her hands are rendered very well. You can tell that they're fingers and not just blanks of space. We have roses going all around the sides over here. And you can even tell that she has on a corset. And then this is the bottom of the mirror that she's standing in. And of course, at the bottom, you're going to have all your kit information and everything as well. So, oh, sorry, I didn't mean to bump you with my elbow. So that is your kit, the wild wood, okay? So now we're gonna take a look at the drills. And if you're someone who doesn't like that noise of the crinkling plastic, please mute your phone for like mm, 30 seconds. Or until you see me stop struggling. All right, so let's get into this. Hopefully you're having a wonderful day. Now we have 39 colors coming in on this kit. So first strand of drills, and you're seeing these in natural sunlight. If you're wondering if you are, yes, you are. So 3371, double trouble there. You're going to get 817 and what in the world? Oh my God, it's the fairy dust drills. 
So these are the drills that have like the glitter on them. Let's frick, ooh, and they're bronze. I guarantee you I know where that's going. Look at that, you guys. We have a special drill. What kind of noise should we make for a special drill? Wah, wah. I don't know. Um, <laughs> so we have this beautiful fairy dust drill coming in for this canvas. And it looks like the drills are actually dipped into this glitter stuff. So it doesn't look like the, the glitter goes the entire way around the drill. It looks like the drill is are literally dipped into the glitter to make it stick to the top of them, which is great because you can still tell what color they are. And it gives you that glittery glow of uh, bronze effect that you're gonna get off those drills. And we'll figure out where those go on your kit here in a few minutes. Let's take a look at the rest of the drills and see what we got. Let's get the big strand of drills, the big old chunkle. It's a little chunky. Let's go. And a B alert right off the bat. We're coming in with that that uh, a B alert We got those roasted marshmallows. Let's go So if you're new to diamond painting, and you don't know what an a B is a B stands for Aurora Borealis It's an iridescent coating that diamond art club puts on the drills or on their drills to make them sparkle Just a little bit brighter and when you lay them down on your canvas next to a regular drill It will make it sparkle brighter as well because if one shines we all shine you heard I don't know why it was so hard for me to get that out But that is what an a B drill is our first one coming in is 117 We're gonna take a look at the rest of the, the colors in this kit and then we're gonna come back and figure out where all these A B's and special drills go So you ready? Let's keep going 498 real quick 920 one, 758, 814, 754, 3064, 3772, 632, 898, 920, 9, 918, 3857, double trouble at 3857 there. We got a lot of browns in this kit. 938, 3858, 310, 1, 2, 3 bags of 310 coming in for this kit here. Sorry, trying to get my life together. 608, 640, 341, 721, 300, 816, 3787, and AB alert. Yes. 107 coming in as another AB in this kit. And again, we're going to figure out where that goes here in a few minutes. So let's keep going. Look how beautiful and vibrant that color is. Oh my gosh. And we're going to figure out where that goes here in a few minutes. So let's keep going through the rest of these drills. We don't got much left. 779, 355, 3021, 934, 154. Remember your ABs are going to be less than 150. 3860, 407, 3356, 3830, 440, 452. 3778 and 451. All right. So those are your drills. And of course, we do that movie magic to get them back in the bag because who has time for all that extra stuff? So uh let's get the bag. And then you just got you just drop it like this. Try it. Just drop it. All right. Did it work for you? No? Try it again. No? Maybe next time. Anyways, drills are back in the bag. Let's take a look at our canvas because we had two ABs. If you remember, it was 117 and 107. And then we had those special drills, which Diamond Art Club tends to put their special drills at the bottom. And you have that little TP with like the little stick sticking out of the top of it. And then you have numbers one and two that we're going to be looking for. So we're going to be looking for that little TP symbol and then numbers one and two. So let's go. So we're looking for like a brownish color for that first one for number one. So let's see if we can find that that or one of the other AB. So I'm seeing some number ones in the hair. So a couple of number ones, where are those number ones go? Was that the hair? Nope, that was on the rose. So the roses are gonna have that, re that red AB and just in the center of them, not the outside, just the highlighting color of that ro those roses are gonna have the ABs. I'm not seeing any ABs in her hair, just on those roses. So there's number one. Now we gotta find that, that honey toasted or oven roasted uh, color that 117 which is that first one that we found which I found it look around the mirror so all around the mirror you're going to see those little white spots which look like white spots but they're really that honey that that brownish color that honey brown so you're going to get that brown color so that those fairy drills are going to go around the edges Ooh, that's going to look gorgeous with those roses. And then number one, we found number one and number uh, 39. So let's see if we can find number 30 or 30. We're going to find a number one. No, two. Two. Number two. So we're going to look for number two now. Because we found where everything else goes. Where does number two go? Because I did not see number two. There's number two there. Her entire corset is number two. So, recap. 
Your roses are going to have a red AB in the center of them, especially the rose in her hand. Around the edges of the mirror, that dotted line you're seeing, that is all fairy dust drills. Now, I don't see anywhere else on the canvas where the fairy dust drills go. So I'm going to assume that they're only around the edge. If there is any more, it'll be a surprise to you. Um, so you're also going to get an AB on the corset that she is wearing. So two ABs and the fairy dust drills are going to make this kit absolutely beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And I have a feeling that this particular kit's going to go quickly as kits like this typically do. So when is this kit going to be available to you? This kit should be available to you April 15th. Now, if you are a Diamond and Ruby member, this kit will be available to you first coming in at 9 a.m. Pacific, 10 Mountain, 11 Central, and 12 Eastern. If you are not a Diamond or Ruby member with Diamond Art Club, don't worry. 30 minutes later, you'll have your chance at this kit. But may the shopping gods be with you because this is going to go quick. So be quick with them fingers, you heard? All right, so I got to get out of here. So again, huge thank you to the folks over at Diamond Art Club for providing this for us. And huge thank you to you for watching. Now, you always know how we do. If you have any other questions, comments, concerns, leave those down in the comment section below and we'll get back to you as soon as we possibly can. But until next time, you guys, stay safe out here in these crafty streets and dangerous. So remember also to be kind to others because you never know what somebody else is going through. Be courteous because it's the right thing to do. And always stay cool. Bye, guys.